3 raised to power s squared divided by 9 raised to power s is equal to 6561. What is the value of x? Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In this class, we want to find the value of s from this given exponential equation. 3 raised to power s squared divided by 9 raised to power s is equal to 6561. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe. Thank you. Solution. We have the given equation t raised to power s square over 9 raised to power s is equal to 6, 5, 6, 1. Then we have 3 raised to power s square over 9 raised to power s is the same thing as 3 square raised to power s is equal to 6, 5, 6, 1. Then remember that if you have a raised to the power n raised to the power m is the same thing as a raised to the power n m. Then we have 3 raised to the power s square over 3 raised to the power 2 s is equal to 6, 5, 6, 1. And remember that 6, 5, 6, 1 is equal to 3 raised to the power 8. Then we have 3 raised to the power s square over 3 raised to the power 2 s is equal to 3 raised to the power 8. Then our left hand side become 3 raised to the power s square minus 2s is equal to 3 raised to the power h. Then they have the same base. This one, we cancel this. We have s square minus 2s is equal to h. Then we have s square minus 2s minus h is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation. And this can be solved by using either factorization method or quadratic general formula, but I'm going to make use of factorization method. Then we have s square minus 4s plus 2x minus 8 is equal to 0. Then we have s into what? x minus 4 plus 2 into x minus 4 equal to 0. Then we have s plus 2 into x minus 4 is equal to 0. Then s plus 2 equal to 0 or s minus 4 is equal to 0. Then we have from here s is equal to minus 2. That is the value of x, or from here we have s minus 4 equal to 0, therefore s is equal to what 4. Then the final answers are s is equal to minus 2 and 4. That is our final answer. Let's check to confirm if our answer is right or wrong. Now let's check. We have the given equation t s square over 9 raised to the power s is equal to 6, 5, 6, 1. But at s equal to minus 2, t raised to the power minus 2 square over 9 raised to the power minus 2 must be equal to what? 6, 5, 6, 1. Now, here, minus 2 squared, this is 4. We have 3 raised to the power 4 over 9 raised to the power minus 2 must be equal to what? 6, 5, 6, 1. Now, here we have 3 raised to the power 4 over 3 raised to the power 2 into minus 2 must be equal to what? 6, 5, 6, 1. Then, this is 3 raised to the power 4 over 
C raised to the power minus 4 must be equal to what? C5, C1. Then in this case, now we have T raised to power minus T raised to power four. Then if this minus four go up, it will be plus four. Now must be equal to C five C one. Then this is T raised to power eight is equal to what C five C one because T raised to power eight is equal to six thousand five hundred and sixty one meaning that the left-hand side is equal to the right-hand side, which satisfies the given equation at S is equal to minus 2. Now, let's check at S is equal to 4. S is equal to what? 4. We have the given equation. T raised to power s square over 9 raised to the power s is equal to 6, 5, 6, 1. Now, at s is equal to 4, we have 3 raised to the power 4 square over 9 raised to the power 4 must be equal to what? 6, 5, 6, 1. And then we have t raised to the power 4 squared, that is 16, over, then t raised to the power 2 into 4 must be equal to 6, 5, 6, 1. Then we have t raised to the power 16 over t raised to the power 8 must be equal to 6, 5, 6, 1. Now, we have T raised to the power 16 minus 8 must be equal to 6, 5, 6, 1. Then we we'll have T raised to the power 16 minus 8. This is 8. It's equal to what? 6, 5, 6, 1. And T raised to the power 8 is the same thing as 6, 5, 6, 1. Meaning that the left hand side is equal to the right hand side, which also satisfies the given equation at S is equal to what? 4. So, our final answers are, we have S is equal to minus 2 and 4. If you have enjoyed the class, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.